Hello, my friend. I'm Abra. For this time, I will introduce the work parameter to you. For the work parameter, we can see here many. Normally, we keep it、uh, default value is okay, and、uh, sometimes we change some. For the first one, the mean motor high max is the high speed limit. We can back back the knitting interface for this one. The high speed we click it's low speed. Click this one we use the high speed, and we can say the high speed limit is one hundred. If you set the value more than one hundred, it's also one hundred. If you set to fifty, it's use fifty. It's like this, and the mean motor low max. Mean motor low max、uh, use the blue button. It's use the low speed. The limit is forty.、Uh, if if you set twenty, it's use twenty. If you setting fifty five, it will use the maximum forty. This value. And the mean motor hand handle. It's the handle bar. For this one, for this one, the speed is twenty.、Uh, the mean motor reset, reset、uh, is this speed. We click the reset and click reset. Then running the machine, this speed is fifteen.、Uh, uh, for the front shock sensor, front shock sensor is.、Uh, When sometimes the needle break, like、uh, here the needle break, then it's、uh, shocked the needle bed, so it will give a alarm. And this sensor value, the sensitive, this is the front and the back, we all use sixty. For the this one is the shock sensor value, uh plus. Mm, this no need. We give zero. The mean ruler act model. Here is the continue. Continue. I think it should be here、yeah, the value for the both side turn. One is continue. Normally we use one. Two is segmented. Is another type of the mean ruler. Zero only after knitting at the two side, it's give the tension. Okay, the main ruler stop tension. This one actually is not work. For this one, main ruler speed limit seventy. Seventy, I think most of the time is enough. Even you setting eighty, it will use this value the limit. Okay, next one, yaw fade enable. Yaw fade is this one. This one we call yaw ruler or yaw fade or yaw supply. For here is the yaw fade enable. We give oh is three. Three is both side. Both side work. Three is on. One is left on. This one is left one. Another side is right side. For this one, it also have a hardware switch for here. And、uh, this cable connected. So if the yaw feed is not work, we need to check the cable, the hardware switch. And、uh, also the parameter from here. If we only use the left side, also we can give number one only left side on, and also we can turn off the hardware switch for the right side one. Normally we give we give back we give three both side it's on. Okay. The fuel maintain keep for the oil add remind 
uh, now it's zero, no information, no tip. If we give yes, when the time reach, it will give a tip to remind you for adding the oil. Carriage refill. What is this? This should be one hundred. This one is the adding oil rule. Here from one hundred to five thousand. Actually, this is not used. For open piece enable, this is for special hardware. For this one is the carriage light control. A different way of the carriage light. You can try the different the telescopic motor. This one is the self run Yavida up down type. This one is the how to say it's the yard carrier. There's an up down device and the carriage they have a cam to push it up down. The cam work in advance time this one. And this one is the uh, when the Yafeder to the edge, it's uh, not work. This one is uh, released in advance time. Okay, and uh, for here, the back sinker reset, front sinker reset. When we reset the machine, the sinker will tip at this value. Rotate tension speed. Rotate speed is the carriage. Uh, we know the carriage, for example, from here to here is the knitting area. And uh, for the carriage, you need to get out a little. And for the speed is this value. We normally keep uh, the default is okay. For next one, the locking crosses. Locking crosses is the one we look at the knitting interface. For here, here is the value we setting. Uh, suppose twenty two. Click yes. After we reset, the locking will twenty two, and the value we set here is not work. After reset, it should be zero maybe. And uh, if we setting here, then every time when you reset the machine, the repeat will use this one, the locking repeat will use this one, the row number one, number two, number one, number two, like this. The boot alarm time, 20, 20 is the 20 second. You can setting depending on your need. Scream save time. This one is five minutes. If you use zero, the scream will always keep on, always light on. If you give five, after five minutes, the scream will shut down. It become black to save. Scream brightness fifty. This one is fifty percent. Uh, normally no need change. For here, sub ruler operate model. Here is also continue. Normally we use the continue one. And also zero, zero is continue. And the one, one is both side. It should be two side. Okay. Sub ruler enable. Here we give a yes. For the color machine, for the first time you use, you need to check this value. Next one, sub ruler stop tension. You give five. It's also depending, depending on the pattern you made. If it's very wide, you need to give some big value. If very small, you should give a small value. It depends.
uh, this value is the same as the value from uh, here you can see this value we change here or change there is same we give a 10 and uh, you can see uh, also the work parameter we can enter from here you see the sub ruler stop tension now it's 10 is the same setting and uh, this only for the machine with the down ruler the sub ruler okay next one sub ruler is there uh what is this there uh, i think it's a device to stop its uh, reruling only ruling uh, one direction here is no it's depending on the hardware no need to change use sensitive use segment should be segment ahead this one we normally keep yes what is this one it's uh, like uh, here you click the density uh, pitch up you can see from here it's the red number red number is the used number and we page down you can see now it's 9 12 14 the used one become upside and the not used one become downside you can see this one is 23 so we only setting the upside the value then no need to check the downside not used so used is upside this uh, is a convenient way to check the parameter okay work parameter next one is a ruler add oil a ruler is sub ruler or down ruler is same it's also depending on the hardware carriage single carriage single ribbon what is this let me check this one is the carriage type adding oil the time how many time the oil for each time how many second it's adding the oil and uh, for this one is the uh, carriage light uh, run delay uh, not important things for the carriage there is uh, light and for the time setting uh, not important for this one we already told and for here auto reset piece this one is uh, for the color we better to set 100 or 200 because the color is very small uh, after 100 for this one we setting 100 after 100 the machine will reset or the cam is resetting da -la -da -la -da -la, like that and uh, to keep the density or something should be correct and uh, for the sweater sometime we can give a small value maybe 20 or 30 and for the color we can give 100 or 200 like that auto reset line auto reset rule this normally no need we keep zero for some time for checking maybe need yeah down advance this one is for the for the normal type of the yeah carrier it's uh, tk you can see yeah carrier is taken by here this one this one for its uh, drop down time it's drop down in 20 20 should be some needle about mm. you also can change normally no need change use the default value yeah not low speed three row yeah not low speed when it's knitting like this the yeah is coming if there is a small knot and it's not uh, too big uh, we allow it to knit but we need to slow down for 
it will eating safe. Otherwise, the fabric may be broken. So this number is the ya knot. After that is a ya knot, and then in three row it will use the low speed to knit. Okay, next one. The clip clean time. The comb clean. This tool is uh, should have the hard device, hard hardware for the blowing device. Okay, this adding arrow interval. This one is the minutes. How many minutes? This one is eight hour. For one time oil adding, then after eight hour, it will adding oil another time. Okay, for each adding oil time, fifteen second. Fifteen second. The weather sound interval. This one also you can try and check what the different for the other. Okay. The ruler drop edit time. This one is for the comb machine. The machine with the comb. If the there is not enough time for the fabric to take down, you can give some more time. The ruler then rolling rolling take the fabric down okay carriage light stop delay is not important thing okay this never use okay for this one we finish and for next one is easy yeah speed correct yeah speed correct we can see here all the value is zero zero yeah feeder down here yeah, feeder up and the speed oh. Oh. here normally we give zero and sometime if the low speed the yard parking is near and the high speed the yard parking is very far then we can set some value suppose uh, uh, here is the speed we found the speed and to change the value if too far then we can minus Three needle, then the parking position will minus three. And for this speed, and for this yaw feeder, we found the yaw feeder, the speed, then change the value. Normally, no need to change. We keep zero or. Oh. And uh, for this one. Next one, return speed, speed adjust. Uh, adjust. For this one, we use the default value no need to change okay and uh, for here we finish and we come back there are two ways to get the work parameter for one is from here this one the one is from the knitting interface here the work parameter also okay Okay, thank you for your watching, see you next time.